Hi! In the next few minutes, we'll take a look at some of the highlights in the latest Load Runner Cloud release. First up, LoadRunner Cloud has new locations for cloud load generators. For AWS, you can select Cape Town. For GCP, you can select Sydney. And for Azure, you can select Sao Paulo. Next, LoadRunner Cloud now integrates with Microsoft Teams to support push notifications. As an administrator, you can define Load Runner Cloud events and indicate which Microsoft Teams channel will be notified when real-time events occur. In the Dashboard's Metrics tree, each metric now shows a More Information button. This button lets you show or hide information related to the metric, such as scripts, transactions, and errors. Next up is support for floating values for percentiles. You can now specify a value with a decimal point for the transaction response time percentile. Beginning with this version, you can also duplicate scripts from within the assets area. This feature lets you broaden your testing capabilities by running the same script multiple times with different configurations. The license area now contains a summary tab. This replaces the allocation tab in previous versions. The summary tab shows administrators a comprehensive summary of entitlement, consumption, and allocation information per license. Check out the Help Center to learn more and enjoy the new LoadRunner Cloud release.